Hello friends, it's Jim O'Rear. Welcome back to Jim O'Rear's Wacky World. Tonight, we are going back over to Universal Studios Florida for Halloween Horror Nights, and we're gonna check out another scare zone. This scare zone is the Demon Queen's Scare Zone, and um, it's a little confusing, and you'll see why, so take a look. All right, here we are in the Demon Queen's Scare Zone daylight version, so that you can see some of the details. Um, when it gets dark, you can't see as many of the details, so I like to show you a little bit in the light so you can you can get an idea of what things really look like. But you'll notice there's there's not a lot in the scare zone. There's there's a lot of people running around, there's a lot of actors running around, but the set pieces are not that spectacular. You know, they've got this big float sitting out here in the middle of the road with some of the demon queens on it. And um, and a couple little smaller things uh, you know, uh, around it, uh, but other than that, I, I don't, I don't know that I understand the scare zone or what they were really going for here. Um, let's turn out the lights. This is what it looks like in the dark, and with the fog and the lights, you know, it is creepy and atmospheric, and you know, I really like the look when it comes down to to the lighting and how they do all of that. But I'm still. I'm still confused. I'm very confused about the theme. And uh, and like I said, like while there are plenty of actors wandering around in uh, you know various costumes and things like that, there's very little to the set, very little. And, and I can't quite figure out the mixture of actors either because some are big rubber mask monsters, some are just face painted um, with black circles on their eyes. I mean, she looks like coral in an ocean with, I don't know, some kind of sea creature. Um, so, uh, I, yeah, I, not even, maybe somebody can explain what they were going for. If, if you, if you know, uh, put it in the comments. Um, you know, somebody who's listened to a Halloween Horror Night podcast or something where they explain what's going on and what their thinking was behind it. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so this is the Demon's, Demon Queen's Scare Zone, and uh, and it's fun. I mean, it's fun because of the atmosphere and the number of actors that are running around, and just to, you know, have somebody in your face all the time. You know, it's, it's kind of, uh, it gives you the feeling that it's uh, unrelenting and that you are not going to get out of the Scare Zone because of so many people surrounding you and in your face all the time. Uh, so that's kind of neat. Um, now they have a couple of icons this year and, and every now and then one of the icons will come take over this zone. So real. How interesting indeed. We must find you something darker to please your twisted heart. My twisted So she's kind of neat. She's kind of a neat character to, to see pop up there and interact with the people and, and talk to them. Um, but overall, I'm, I, you know, uh, you can see more of the scare zones on this channel with, with other videos that I've put up there with, um, you know, just kind of focusing on the different scare zones this year. You'll notice that um, the scare zones, they almost, you know, and I said this last year too, they're almost like an afterthought 
they just kind of went, eh, let's just, let's put this there and this there and this there and throw some actors around it and <clears throat> cover it up in fog. And there you have it. Uh, so <clears throat> kind of disappointed with the scare zones this year, but, uh, but they're still fun and atmospheric. But that is a look inside the Demon Queen Scare Zone. There you go. That is a look inside that Demon Queen scare zone over there at Universal Studios Orlando's Halloween Horror Nights. So keep watching this channel all Halloween season long. We're going to be featuring more and more haunts and scare zones and specialty foods and Halloween shopping and all that kinds of stuff. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have, click that like button to let the powers that be know that you like the video. And while you're at it, click on follow or subscribe and you'll be notified when I upload new videos. So thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time.